Hey there guys, Chris here with Min Media. Today I want to give you my honest review on Pictory AI. This tool is revolutionizing the video content creation process and a lot of content creators are using this to next level their content. So if we take a look at the features tab here, we have endless things we can do. One of the most common things is the text to video. That's what Pictory AI is known for. And today I'm going to show you how to do this. It's a quick demo, how good of results you can get. And just look at all these other things you can do. We have the Facebook video maker, corporate video maker, video transcription, we can add captions to video. This is one of my favorite tools in my arsenal and there's just so much you can do. So what Pictory is most commonly known for is this, scripting to video and article to video, essentially text to video. Pictory uses AI technology to create, to take your text, essentially your transcript or any text whatsoever and turn it into a video. So let's do something pretty cool. Let's just test this. Uh, let's Google search how to make faceless videos, right? And I'm looking for an article that's gonna give us some things we can use here. Let's copy and paste some of this. Again, it's from creatorfasttrack.com. Uh, I'm just gonna copy and paste this and then I'm gonna paste it in here. So click on the proceed here and just paste this. Little bit of advice, uh, break up your videos by paragraphs or break up your paragraphs so that it can kind of transition into different like screens, if that makes sense. Because what Pictory does is it uses AI to break up and find different scenes that are correlated. It, it finds video scenes that are correlated to your text. So then it's literally this simple. I paste it in here and click on proceed. And then I let AI essentially make the video for me. So how does this save time? Well, that seems really obvious to me. I don't have to do any video video editing, I don't have to learn video editing, and if I have text, I can create videos. So again, guys, uh, consider taking a look at Pictory AI using the link down below. It is my affiliate link, but guys, you got to support creators, right? All right. So here's what Pictory looks like. This is what the dashboard looks like. And there's just so much to do here. This is a glorified video editor in itself. That's like a hybrid of like AI. And it just, what it does is it takes video editing and it makes it simple for like normal people to like be able to get in here and create videos. So what I'm going to do here is I am going to change the scene duration and essentially this means how fast does how fast do the scenes change and because I want to keep video retention I kind of make it lower I change it to like four seconds and then I apply it to all the scenes and what you can do here you can add background music you can add voiceovers you can trim spots each one of these down here are the different selections or the different scenes that it's adding to your video and what's really cool here is again, you can go in here and edit it. You can add new scenes. If over here on the left, we can clat, we can add visuals, audio, styles, text, branding. If we go back to the features tab here, these are all the things we can do. You can do transcription, you can do a uh, subtitle generator, caption generator. Like this is one of my all-in-one video editing programs that like gets used on the daily. And I would pay double the amount if like I, if I had to for Pictory AI. Like, so my review on this tool, it's an absolute game changer. But guys, let's take a look at my results and just, I think that's gonna speak for itself. All right, so to see the video, all we have to do is click on the right-hand tab up here where it says preview. That's really cool and it essentially just builds it for you. This is what our video looks like right here. Click play and it literally created a video for us. And again, this watermark might be freaking you out. You're like, what is that? But when you export your videos, it actually isn't on your video. And you have to get the pro version of this tool to have it remove that watermark. So hopefully that makes sense. But if you guys wanted to test this tool out, again, using my link in the description, you will get a free trial just to test it. So it's like you have nothing really to lose. And it created this whole video by essentially me just pasting in this text. I don't know guys, if you don't see like the importance of this, Let's see, let me show you some other cool features here quick. So if I wasn't happy with certain sections of the video, all I would have to do is just highlight the selection of the actual video like I don't like. So I'd click on that and then I click the delete button and it's that quickly to just remove. And if I wanted to add new like sessions or transition, like scenes, I guess you would call them, just click over here in the visuals tab and just search for stuff. Faceless video. video and just hit enter and then search it. And this is going to be the entire archive of things you can literally just add to your video. Again, just click the plus button and it gets added to your video. And I can just sit here and add these and I can do overlays and it's, 
This is a glorified video editor built in, which is crazy. So let's talk about YouTube automation. So what I do and have a lot of success with is I actually start by creating the video, right? I'll throw the text in there, and honestly, it really doesn't matter where you get the text because honestly, I don't use, I, I advise people not to use the AI voiceovers just because I think the algorithms are moving towards hating AI voices. So that's my personal feedback. I think that you should be doing personal voiceovers or hiring someone. That's probably the best option if you want longevity in YouTube automation. So then what I do is I create the video and I make sure it's decent. You know, like I watch it, I go in here and I have the transitions. And then what I'll do is I'll create a script. A lot of times I'll use ChatGPT or just think of a script myself. I'll, I'll use like an outline and just use my own words. The trick here to, to passing all these algorithm passes or these these like strict criteria with AI is to be as creative as you can and use as many element like personal elements of your own as you can. So actually right here in Pictory, what I do is I just click on add voiceover and you can record the voiceover in here. You can record it on your phone. If you click on record here, if you click the, the record button, it will literally just start recording and it works again. Um, sometimes I find that if I put, if I do the voiceover on my phone and edit it in an actual editor, it actually sometimes helps build, uh, helps edit it there because it is somewhat difficult to edit on Pictory. This is more, this is more or less like Pictory is best for kind of creating the actual videos because you can literally scroll in here and I can add so many different types of videos, like all the elements. And that's where the faceless feature comes in. And then I don't have to have my, my, like the front face camera, what you're seeing right here. So if I click on this plus button, I can click on visual only, and then I can click on this right here and it adds this, this video and we're good to go. Like it's that simple. And now that's part of my video. You can also add a lot of other things. There's the style tab, the text tab. You can add text. Uh, a lot of people do like overlays of text. You know, like if you're talking about something, you can add branding to it. If you have a logo, you can also do like uh, basic shapes and stuff. You can do captions. I will give a forewarning that if like you're looking to get into Pictory and just kind of create like crappy AI voiceover videos, I've tried it and I feel like it's, I feel like you're going to have a lot much better luck kind of like scripting your video to have a hook and then have like look into scripting get hooks and then figure out a real voiceover that's my advice to you that was kind of a game changer as soon as i figured out that if i started using a real human voiceover that the algorithms appreciated it much more so my review on pictory is very high i use this tool almost daily and again um this is just, if you're looking to do youtube automation or just create videos for companies uh, there's a lot you there's a, there's a lot to be done here a lot of people are making money on like Fiverr selling these videos to companies and it's funny because this is just stock b-roll footage that anyone can get at storyblocks if you have a paid membership but Pictory creates these videos for us so like people are making a lot of money just selling these videos putting them on social media and again what's really cool is we can change the orientation to have this vertical video so if we click right here it's landscape right now which would be like youtube long form but if we click on portrait this is going to be what tiktok is and stuff and again obviously you can expand the video again this is a next level tool that a lot of people are using a lot of creators aren't even talking about it because they don't want people to know because a lot of people are making tons of money so i just figured i'd do an honest video on my review on pictory ai again consider using my affiliate link in the description you will get a free trial with that and yeah, hit me up in the comments. Uh, are, like, what are you doing? What's your process? Where are you at? Are you looking to make money? Make sure to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.